Now I'm a little worried about leaving so many lights on the keyboard on, but I'm also worried about continually turning the machine on and off, on and off. It puts extra stress on the entire system. So I've decided to turn off my LEDs on one of the banks. You have four different bank colors anyways. I'm going to make bank A with all the LEDs turned off. Let me show you the quick way to do that first. You just press control on the left side once, twice, thrice. That'll show you these squares which represent your eight pads. Just push your enter button once. And then use your arrows to go over to color. Over there on the bottom right. And then tap a pad and spin your wheel to the bottom. Off. Tap the next pad. Spin the wheel to the bottom. Off. Tap the next pad. Off. Tap. Off. Tap. Off. Tap. Off. Tap. Off. Off. Done. Okay, and then like usual in my other tutorial, shift global, right page over to the far right, and push to save so it remembers your setup. And the next thing you want to do that I plan to do is again go into shift global, page left, 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 and on screen brightness, I'm going to bring that down to about three so it doesn't sit there glaring when I'm not using the keyboard and if this bright light wasn't on for you to be able to see the screen would be plenty bright anyways uh, yeah and then once again if you make any kind of change in the system where it's not pertaining to its connection to the computer you always want to save your global settings in that far right page like that and you're done